I wanna be right there with you, baby So I can warm you up, love is so cool where you are Have plenty of kids to give ya Even though we're not together everybody today is monday music monday at www.poeticexpressions.com hope everyone had a great weekend and it's monday here already again so make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel if you haven't already done that and today we are talking about danity kane in case you don't know who they are they were selected in diddy's making the band season in 2005 to form the group danity kane and it comprised uh, five different women and basically, if you don't know the story, Aubrey Day was kicked out of the group, and then they were left with just four. But the group origin, uh, eventually disbanded, and then Don Richard went on to do solo career as well as uh, being in Diddy's group, Dirty Money. Now that all of that has kind of gone by the wayside, which is ironic because Don just recently released a new CD, or her first official CD, Golden Heart, a few months ago, they are talking about doing another Danity Kane reunion. Uh, they all had lunch a couple weeks ago, and now they're talking about reuniting, but Dee Woods is not down with it. She was invited and did not show up and said she's working on her solo CD, uh, which has yet to really see the day of light, but she's done a few mixtapes, and hopefully her solo CD will be out soon. I never really got into Danity Kane. Um, to me, they were just kind of a gimmick group. That's just my opinion. But I really did like Dee Woods. I thought she was the best member of the group to me. I mean, I thought she was the sexiest one. Uh, she brought an edge to the group. So without her, it's going to be interesting to see how they do. But Don doesn't seem too phased by it. She's pretty much saying to just let her go on her own separate way. But without the backing of Diddy and making the band, be it how good or horrible of a manager he was to them. One thing is for sure is that he definitely brought some attention to the group. So they want to reunite, but without him being their manager and without Dee Woods. So what do y'all think? Do you think they'll even succeed? You know, what are y'all's thoughts on it? Are you even a Danny Kane fan? Do you even care? Is there really a demand for them to come back? And also later today, make sure you stay tuned for my review on a new song about Benjamin Button. Yep, there's a song by Benjamin Button. Not exactly, but in a roundabout way it is. And stay tuned to my website, www.poeticexpressions.com to find out exactly who I'm talking about. And make sure to read my article on Danity Kane. It's called Danity Kane Without the D. And that's also at www.poeticexpressions.com. Thanks for tuning in to Music Monday, and see you all next week.